Good morning, plumbers. As you know, we do everyday plumbing, the good, the bad, and the ugly. Follow us on this journey as I train my two sons. The plumbing trade for today's adventure. For today's adventure, we have a toilet we're going to put in plaster. It's a little wobbly, so I brought some plaster to do my first plaster job on film. Wobbly toilet. So, same, same thing. We're going to uh, shut, off, shut it down, the drain the tank, move the lid, undo the bolts, and we're going to assess the situation. And we're going to set this baby on some plaster. I think. Okay, because I think the floor is a little messed up. All right, pal. Have at it. Oh, okay. Bam. Low radiation, you know, that's good. Yeah, you know, that's good, he's my right hand. Excess water. Put it down there, you're gonna get some water. Now, I'm gonna show you the situation. I want you to do this, but I want I, I, I gotta show you this because I already saw this coming in oh, in here that with the tile floor. See all the loose tile? Yeah. Ah. So I'm, turning, I'm just laying it sideways so I don't pull up cool. no tiles. So I'm going to rock it back and forth. And there goes one in the back coming up. I'll show you in one second. See where my elbows are? Yeah. Now, why is this land moving so much? You can see with a good seal, nice and dry. So we're going to scrape up the caulk, all right? Mm -hmm. And we're going to set this thing in plaster because it just... Are you going to leave the bowl? No, we're going to change that. Okay. All right, so take that off. Let's lay this tool in the back here a little bit so you got some room to work. Now, we put these toilets in, I don't know, a year or two ago. And 
I said in caulk, and the tenants somehow managed to create a rocking toilet anyway. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to double check the flange, make sure. Go ahead, take that wax off of there. Put the last stuff in the bucket. Here, do you know now? John, you, you, you gotta start work on your knees because you can't work on Oh, well, yeah, I was going to, but you took the knee. I didn't take it, I'm just, I'm, I was looking at something. Oh, I got bad knees, you know that. You no know bad knees, stop your crying. Boom, right in, the, right in the trash can. The trash bucket. Now, I just saw something move here. Okay, it's pretty tight, man. Turn a screwdriver, let's see what we got. Have a little chisel screwdriver or a chisel itself. Of course, they got some cheesy screws in here, I see. See, this floor is caving in a little bit. Like this? We got a little bit of a floor. No. Oh, I'm sorry. You want that? Yeah. Uh, give me this. This is good. I was going to do that. Let's see what this floor is here. I'm kind of terrible. See, this is all wood. It's kind of floating. Tight as hell. Let me see my quarter, see if I can pop a couple of these off. And then we'll put some other screws in here. You got some screws? Yeah, grab a screw gun. Bring that whole box of screws in because we might be doing multiple things here, Ange. situation with the floor here. We're going to re-screw this even though it's nice and tight and we're going to set this in plaster. It's currently vacant. This one's stripped like, so look what I'm gonna do. I'm actually twisting. Put pressure up on the head itself. It still isn't working, so. You got four. Yeah. Oh my god, that ain't doing shit. Ugh. Alright. What we got for screws? Give me some wood screws. Oh, much better. <laughs> what happened here, dude? Oh, hell yeah, dude. It's the only problem is there's definitely a floor situation. Again, you don't want to tighten it and pop this ring off the ABS. It's a two-part flame. That's why I don't like the metal rings. Sounds good. Okay. So I'm tighten it down. We'll go back in there. We gotta scrape all this caulk off, okay? Mm -hmm. Without popping the tiles off. Alright, let me see that wax bar. Now, I'm going with my first plaster toilet set on some ratty tile with a floor that's kind of saggy waggy highly recommended by some boys out of New York now my flash is a little wet I'm letting it set up a little bit which I could do this 
set this tile. That'd be a nice move by me. That'll be in there, boom. I like that already. Goes in there nice. All right, Ansh. Trash away. Now look. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go right around the, right around the whole toilet with this. Right. Make a little bit of a mess around the old spot. It's a little wet. I'm kind of liking it though. Alright, we clean the clear the flange. Bang. Just like before, I'm gonna go left bolt first. Okay, left bolt in. Coming down. Oh, look at that. We leave it like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only kidding. My scraper. Clean one? No, no. That ball right there again. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to clean all the access out. Should have got that big cap. Okay. Huh? Nope. Pull that flashlight back for me, Angie. Cool. I got a little, little extra on the end. Uh, I feel in this grout. Yes, uh, uh, these tubs and tacks. That's fire department terminology, son. You tighten these down first, okay? Good job, Angelo. Okay. Here, same thing. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, mm -hmm. we're giving our plaster a chance to set up. And I'll be honest with you, I'm not sure how it's even going to work. But it's a good test for me. What is it? Plaster all over me. Of course you do. You're not paying attention to what you're doing. Why don't you hit your head again? I hit your, your head. Hey, boys and girls out there, plumbers. Oh, here we go. Us plumbers. You know what happens when we move fast in a confined space. What happens? You hit your head a lot. Andrew already hit his head twice today. Alright. Oh, Let's make sure this is nice and square. nice let's tighten it up we will give it a little retight on the final now fuck it fuck it And be a little bit too wet, boys and girls. Hold that for me. What we don't want to do is wash any of this down the sink. Because it will. It will clog up the drains. Outside, rinse this in the hose, but uh, make sure you uh, wash it all down, okay? I'm gonna hook the water back up.
I think my only mistake was this. I made mean, this a little too wet for the situation. So. Oh, yeah. You okay? Her was kind of exploded on her. Oh, God. <laughs> you got more problems. Are you scared of water? You want to show everybody how wet you are? I'm not wet. I'm just drizzling out there. We'll let this set up. Yeah, do I turn the water on already? Yeah. Yes, I did. Yes, you did. Look at this. We even filled in the old grout spots that were missing. <laughs> Speaking of CB, we want to give a special shout out on this day, a day late. I didn't do no filming yesterday for CB2. CB2 is 22 today. 22 plus 1. Happy birthday, CB2. If you guys want to reach out to CB2, you can reach him in the comments below. Ask him what he did on his 22nd birthday. You know, he thinks he's old now. I don't know why. Alright. You want to drive town? Yeah. Let's rinse this one out again. Yeah, yeah. Take this one too. Take this tract. You know what? Take all three of these out. All right, here. Take that one here. I'll take this. We'll let this dry. We can bang it out of the pot. Yeah, yeah. We'll clean at the shop. Yeah. And that's it, folks. I'm no plaster expert. I got no ego. I got a little plaster on my hand. But I can tell you already that it's looking nice. We got a floor situation going on. And, uh, you know, hopefully this will solve it. But you know what really has to happen here? And we all know what has to happen. They got to take up the tile. Replace the plywood and set the floor. And we'll pass it on like we always do. But right now, Airbnb is now open. We're open for business, everybody. Tighten that up. No leaks. Always remember your packing nut. If you could let me know in the comments below also how my plaster job was. Do I make it looser like cement? I mean a little tighter? Let me know. I appreciate the uh, the support. It's a wrap, Palsy. Bring us all out, out to the kitchen. Clean us up a little bit in here. And we'll let that set up. To really fix this situation, this floor needs a little help. Because I'm thinking that the toilet's getting loose from actual the floor being soft, like Angelo. You mean soft? How'd you get wet? Working hard, sweat. How many times did you hit your head today? Let's test it out. And 
that, my folks, is a Gerber flush. Boom, done. All right, that was my first plaster job. Right now the unit's empty and it's gonna have plenty of time to set up. I'm really curious how it works, but we all know that that floor is saggy waggy in the left hand corner. I'm thinking it won't work, but hey, we passed it on to the owner. We'll see what happens. Anything, Angelo? My head well, hurts. Your head hurts. We'll see you at the next one, folks.